All right, guys, you're welcome to Nandavara, where we give you trending updates happening for the country. To my returning subscribers, thank you for joining me. Okay, guys, you welcome back. So, currently, APC is threatening in the north after doing Okupe, who is the campaign director of um, Peter Obi's movement organization said that other party will merge with Peter Obi's party to ensure victory in the 2023 election. Now, according to Don Yokwe, he said that AMPP is merging with a um, Labour Party. Or more, guys, <laughs> this has given a refile goose bump. Guys, as it is now, Labour Party has become the second most contested party in Nigeria. Yes, now, because it's so crazy that it has a... Um, it overtook PDP. Now, it's no longer PDP and that's why Atiku was trying to persuade Peter Robi to come back to PDP. But I hope he doesn't buy that offer. It's just a ploy. It's a costly one, an expensive offer. And if he eventually does that, which I don't pray for, <laughs> the youth of Nigeria will see him as a confused person and someone who if he eventually emerged as the president, can be controlled easily, can be deceived easily. Yes, now. So, Atiku was also making the request so that he can make him a running uh, candidate because the PDP and the APC now are looking for running candidates. Yes, Tinubu is still looking for running candidates. Atiku is still looking for running candidates. This is a decisive offer. What a tempting offer and a joke. Hmm. God should help us. So they think um, Peter B is not smart. One, he is smart for leaving the PDP. And now, two, if people want to try his intelligence again, God no go shame us. Some people even advise him not to come back, that it's all a ploy. And there is a way he will come back now. They will just dump him, like where you lick orange and throw away. This is Ninja. Everything is possible. Now, let's look at what's doing your. Okupe even said that um, all other parties will merge with the Labour Party because of the popularity of Peter Obi. Of course, Kwa Kwaso has to be the running mate of Peter Obi. For those people thinking Kwa Kwaso will want to run as the president, but we still fear that the um, Labour Party would want to change the size of the table and make Peter Obi run as the vice president. You know, anything can happen if this is politics. Look at how the North has taken over APC, which was formed by and uh, has a majority, being ACN, which was conquered by Tinubu and Co. and some governors. Well, guys, right now APC is on hot soup, or in hot soup rather, because <laughs> Labour Party is projected to be number one party. Yes, with all the movement that is ongoing, the youth are taking it by force. You know, there is a strong force. Now, in fact, uh, the way Peter Obi has taken over Southwest, more than Tinubu, is so alarming. Peter Obi has promised to fix Nigeria under four years, even though this may be one of uh, this may, uh, one of the the uh, what people have been saying, the past presidents have been saying. But when you go back to see some things Peter Obi did in Anambra, I think he, I think he is the man for the job. Nobody is going to oppose Peter Obi when it comes to business. Because he has a lot of ideas in his medulla of Langata. So you see why APC is threatening and uh, threatening, and you see why they are uh, they are doing all this Muslim Muslim movement. Because they want to pick uh, Erufai and can only be in the north. But see it now that Labour Party is seriously moving to the north too. Even the former president of Nigeria, Obasanjo, has jumped into the wrong wagon. And he was the one encouraging you before. Just look at Peter Obimoto. Moving Nigeria from um, consumption to production, mm. and I think Peter Obi is the man for the job, like I said before. And this is where I will match break on this matter. Um, I will say thank you to you guys, and then um, please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more trending and entertaining gist that is going viral. And also make sure you share this video. Have a wonderful day.